Welcome guys back to another Unfiltered Gamer board game live stream for the game Flamecraft by Cardboard Alchemy, designed by Manny Vega and uh, published by Peter Vaughn with uh, fabulous artwork by Sandara Tang. Uh -huh. And my uh, co-publisher is Brad Brooks. Brad so, Brooks, a designer of Rise of Tribes. Right, yes. exactly. And Letter Tycoon. And Letter Tycoon, that's yeah. correct. Actually, mm -hmm. we just played that yesterday. Um, additionally, uh, this is their second game. Their first game we played here on the live stream was called Mission Catastrophe. Mm -hmm. And uh, Flamecraft is the... Soon, actually. Yeah, and yeah. So Flamecraft is the second uh, game uh, that you guys are publishing, right? Mm -hmm. uh, why don't you go ahead and tell us a little about it? Sure. <laughs> Uh, absolutely. So, uh, Flamecraft, we've gone from outer space, we've come down into this uh, fantasy world, but dragons are not what, you've, what you're what you used to. They're not these giant beasts that destroy, destroy towns. <laughs> Instead, they're tinier. They're little artisan dragons that make uh, wonderful cups of coffee, the best meat you've ever tasted. They craft plus one swords. They are <laughs> your friends, okay? And we are flame, cra uh, flame keepers, and we happen to speak dragon, so we can help them find their home in town. So we're going around and we are placing, uh, we're, we're going around town and we're actually placing these dragons in the shops. And as we do so, we're earning reputation and gold coins, because you know, dragons are all about the gold. Oh, and yeah. what we're doing is we're getting this reputation and as we do so, the shops are getting full and the, and the dragons combo. And so we're doing something we're calling, it's a shared town building. So after I make a shop, great, then Callie can make it even better. And the combos start to happen in town as we go. Beautiful. Yeah. So this is a uh, two to five players? It's two to five, yep. It is a competitive game, and it takes roughly about an hour or so to play. Yeah. Plus absolutely. a little more with our, our little explanation of the rules that we're probably going to be getting here, because none of us have played the game before, except I hope you have played the game before. <laughs> I've played the game plenty of times. Doesn't um, mean I'll uh, win at all, but, uh, you know. Uh, is this your favorite game you guys have created so far? <laughs> well, what if no what if the designer of Mission Catastrophe is watching this? Yeah, no, no pressure. It's a great game, so oh, I'm very good, excited. Good choice about of it. words. I always <laughs> want to put them on the, on the spot to see if I can catch. Here's them. A, I will tell you something about you know cardboard alchemy is definitely into the thematic games, right? The games that have that are pouring with this kind of theme. So when we saw these cute little dragons, we knew that this was a game we had to make. I find awesome. it more engaging when you really are that thematic because then it gets you more immersed in the world of the game then. So. Mm -hmm. yeah. Absolutely, right? All right, well, I am pretty much, I think, ready to go. Is there anything else you want to say about the game when it's going to be coming on Kickstarter, MSRP, yeah, let's, let's something talk, like let's that? Yeah, let's talk about the Kickstarter date, which is August 10th. Okay, August 10th. And then everybody can come. We're going to have so a preview a page weeks. up a little bit before August 10th. And we have a Facebook group, too, where we share a ton of like behind-the-scenes art and everything else like that. So if anyone wants to come in a little early, they can do that. And I should also mention we have a, a contest going on right now. We often do these pre-launch puzzles where you can win a mini if you play along with the puzzles. And those are done by Rich Molina Weber. He always does a great job with those. So we have ways to like sort of jump in already. Okay. Is Gary yeah. watching? There's minis. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> we do have little mini dragons you can add, right? But uh, thank you for mm -hmm. watching. A lot of people here showing up. Jason, nice to see you. The art of Sundara. Uh -huh. I hope I'm saying that right. Yeah. As the mm -hmm. artist. And um, all the rest of you that I've missed in the comments as it, the artwork was going at the beginning of the stream, we showed some of the artwork for the game. And if you're watching on YouTube, I'm probably showing you a slideshow of the artwork right now as uh, Peter was talking about the game and... Uh, and we're discussing this kind of stuff. Uh, the game, uh, this playthrough will be available on YouTube, and we'll be cutting it up and editing it for YouTube's uh, sake. Probably tomorrow it'll be up. Uh, but right now it's just going to be on Facebook, so we can make sure the connection stays as, as pristine as humanly possible. If there's any audio or visual quality downgrades, please let me know so that I can go ahead and adjust them. Right now we have Max in the comms, and um, if uh, there's something that needs to be added or changed, let us know so we can make sure it sounds good, audio or whatever, okay? Uh, but I think we're pretty much ready to go, so we're okay. gonna go ahead and jump into the top-down mode and you'll still see us as well. Click. <laughs> All right. There we go. Uh, Do it. it looks good. All right. Um, comments hopefully so popping we'll up as well, but we'll see. Uh, but, our there we go. Yep. But it does look like we're, we're good. Uh, we, got, we have everything ready. So now here's the the top down version of the game here. Yes. And I can go ahead and we probably yeah, can, we can move this, we'll move really this nice. over. Yeah. And we'll move this closer. And uh, we'll try not to, don't slam your hands on the table and, or do any of this kind of like knocking. Well, it's, it's hard. Sometimes you don't think about it. I was doing it last stream where I was tapping oh. this the, the stuff. And it makes audio noise and issues like that. So. 
Sorry. I'm going to move this out of the uh, frame <laughs> so you guys can see that. But uh, this is the game of Fr Flamecraft. We've started up for four players, I imagine. I believe each of us is going to be in one of these shops. Is that what we're looking at? Or is it each uh, of those areas? Build the shops together. I will tell you what we're going to do. Each of you can pick a color dragon to move around. So there's the crystal dragon, the bread dragon, the meat dragon, the iron dragon, the plant dragon, and the potion dragon. Which one would you like to do? Awesome. Oh, the iron giant, please. <laughs> <laughs> You take that one. I'll be the meat dragon. Right. Okay, so take that. I'll I just watched the um, the new Space Jam movie and had the Iron oh, Giant. How is it? I saw there's a lot of cameos. Well, I, did, I did not like it. The, okay. So we only need the token colors for ours. So this year's is a white one. Okay. We've got the gray one in there, red one, and leave okay. the green one in there. And then we'll take the purple one. Oh, I don't take, see yeah, a whole lot of cards in this game. Purple and yellow out. Gotcha. Okay. I don't see a whole lot of cards in this game, actually. Uh, yeah, they're mostly dragons. So we'll. Uh, oh no, no, there are. They're all yeah, little tiny cards. Okay, I do but see. But there's mostly, but it's mostly dragons. So basically, Go figure. yeah. So John so has son. <laughs> no dragons for you. I'm never gonna order is this. Is that a shirt. dragon on your shirt? It is. Of course. Wait, oh, yeah. technically Charizard yeah. is not a dragon, right? Is that a, get well, we'll, we'll, we'll have to do a count. This has Charizard X and Y. Charizard X actually is dragon type. So yes. We'll have to do a count of how many dragons actually appear, but there are a ton. So. It, basically, one of the things you want to know is that there are six main types of artisan dragons, okay? Mm -hmm. So when we were picking, that's what I was saying. There's bread and there's meat, iron, potion, plant, and crystal. Those are the types of dragons you're going to get input in town, okay? So you're going to have a hand of dragons in your hand. On your turn, what you're going to do is you're going to go to a shop, okay? Now, you have to go to a new shop every turn. So if I was already at the Smith Mart, I would then go over here to drop a bell. So basically, <laughs> you can go to any shop you want. Now, if there's someone there, you do have to pay them a resource of your choice when you show up, okay? If there are two people there, you have to pay each of them a resource. But there's no blocking in our dragon placement, okay? So you can go anywhere you want in town. When you go somewhere in town, you're gonna choose one of two things to do. You're either going to gather, we're not gonna do that when we're in town. <laughs> we're, gonna, uh, we're gonna gather resources or we're going to enchant, okay? So let's talk about gather first. When you show up at a shop, you're going to gather the little icon. The little icon in the, sh in the corner shows you what the, t the store makes. That resource. Right? Okay. So if you go to Dunkin' Dragons, it makes bread. Now, when you go there, you get a bread for Dunkin showing Dragons. up. Dunkin' Dragons. Yeah. Love it. <laughs> so, yeah, Manny loves the puns, and so we've stuck a lot of them in here. So, oh, yeah. <laughs> so if you, go, if you go there, you get bread. Now, it's kind of like, you know, they, they hand out free samples at all these shops, okay? So you just go, and they show you, they give you a bread. Now, if there was a dragon already there, you would also get a bread because it's every, every time you see a dragon, they also hand you something. So if I went there and, and Toast was already working at Dunkin' Dragons, I would get one bread for the shop and one bread for Toast being there. Okay. okay. The next thing that you can do when you go to a shop is then you can place a dragon at the shop. This is optional. So if I went there and I didn't have a dragon that matched, that's fine. I can just go to the to, to the to bakery and then I can just have a have a turn there but mm -hmm. if i had say so let's say toast was already there and i had this one hot dog mm -hmm. uh, is one of my favorites so mm -hmm. hot dog so you can place a dragon on your turn oh it when doesn't you, have to match that shop. it does have to match but see here's where it matches the bottom of the shop has slots oh, I those see. slots okay. tell you what dragons are allowed to be there okay. so you're allowed to put a meat dragon here and a iron dragon over so this okay. one you can put a plant. So we could put a plant or a bread. Okay. So it'll tell you what dragon can go there. So in this particular case, a bread or a meat can go in the second slot. And if I put that dragon on there, th then what you do is you get the reward that's listed on that slot. Okay. Hearts are reputation. That's this track in the middle that we're all trying to get the most of. Okay, mm -hmm. so that's the reputation track. Whenever you see hearts, that's points. If you see a little gold coin, that is you take a coin, mm -hmm. and the coins are wild resources but they are also points at the end of the game. So if you don't spend it, it's a point as well. Okay. The last one is Fancy Dragons. That's this deck right here. Now Fancy Dragons, they don't work in the shops. They're just having fun, they're goofing <laughs> around. But in this game, they're also end game goals. So if you get one, it might say, well, if you have the most meat at the end of the game, you get some more points. Or if there's a certain amount of bread dragons out in town, you get some points. Okay. So if you ever go to one of these symbols, you'll just draw another Oh, fancy dragon. And those are secret? Those are secret. Those yeah. are hidden. You can have as many of those as you'd like. Okay? 
What do you mean go to? So I mean that so, you have a dragon you words, get that. So then? whenever you place a dragon on that slot with that oh, symbol, mm-hmm. you get it the means card you're one gonna time. take fancy dragon. Okay. Okay. You could choose any slot or you have to build up. You to... you could choose any slot. So okay. if I was to come here oh. and it was the first time I was coming here, I could place hot dog in this slot mm-hmm. which shows a gold coin and then I would get a gold coin for yeah. going there. Okay. Now once you're done placing a dragon, which again is optional, you, know, you come here and don't you don't have to place one. Then you get to fire a dragon. Now it's not like <laughs> sending them home; they don't lose their job. Firing, as in they're activating, ah. they're using their 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 special flame craft. Firing them up. Oh. You're firing them up. When you, I thought you were going a different way. I thought you were going to make them put them in the fire and like no, cook them or something. They have magical <laughs> fire, and you're going to ask them for a favor. You do not have to ask the dragon that you just put down to mm-hmm. perform the favor. So. I could come here, place hot dog, get the gold coin, but then ask Toast to, to do, do the thing. activating, do the okay. firing. So basically, each one of these dragons has powers. On the flip side of your card, you're going to see all six powers. So every bread dragon does the same thing. Every meat dragon does the same thing. So you just have to kind of get used to the six, okay? Okay. But so if I wanted to do, for example, Toast, what the bread dragons do is they draw another dragon. And there's going to be these dragons out at the park that don't have jobs yet. And so you'll just use the bread dragons to get these dragons, okay? So there'll be a couple out of the park. Job hunting dragons. That's right. So that's what you do. So if you okay. want more dragons in your hand, that's you're going to go use a bread dragon. Okay. Now the meat dragons, what they do is they place another dragon on that same turn. So if I happen to have these in my hand and I place hot dog, I can also put opal wing, you know, all the way over here. So you can anywhere with the oh. meat dragon, you can place another one anywhere in town and get the reward. Okay. 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 Um, the plant dragon, you know, sometimes people gift plants, and this is the theme of this one. So Heck you yeah. have to, you give someone an item to get to reputation with the plant dragon. Okay. Okay. With the crystal dragon, they make beautiful things, so you get three different items. So three, you can't take two bread. Uh, you could take one bread, one meat, and one so potion. Three so items. three different things with okay. those. And the iron dragons just forge away at the same type of item. So if you go and you activate a Iron Dragon, it makes two of a kind. Those two can be anything showing in the shop or with a dragon. So if there was this Forge Dragon right here, he could make uh, two bread, two iron, or two meat. It's your choice. But they have to do the same thing. They have to do the same thing. Okay. The last one, the trickiest one, is the Potion Dragon. The reason why it's tricky is because it is a wild that can be swapped with any other dragon, and it violates the rules. So for example, if this was a Potion Dragon over here, and you go there, when you activate it, you can switch it with any other dragon and violate the spots. All of a sudden, you know, the bread would never be able to be placed there, but you can swap with any dragon, and then you fire the dragon that you swap in. So that means that the potion dragon can be anything. You can choose a dragon from the park, so if this was like this, I could say, well, Jasmine's gonna go to the park, but this crystal dragon's gonna come here instead, and then fire the crystal dragon. So the potion gives you a lot of flexibility. It's uh, these dragons are, uh, they've had too much caffeine and they're just running around. <laughs> so on your turn, you're either gonna gather, okay, or you're going to en- enchant. Let's talk about what enchant is like. There's one more thing on the gather turn, which is if the shop has a power, you would do that at the very end. All the starter shops mm-hmm. don't have powers, but as more shops come out into town, those powers will happen. And the way okay. a new shop does come into town is if any time. A shop gets three dragons. We just take a new shop and put it out, and so the town starts to expand and get lots oh. more fun. Happening. How many shops yeah. usually will you see at the end of a game? Usually between nine and twelve shops will oh, wow. come out, okay. and you can go all the way up to fourteen. Okay. Uh, and on the Kickstarter, we're going to unlock so many, so that when you start your, you make your deck, you can just put in whatever shops you'd like. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. So uh, enchanting. Now, the way enchanting works is there's going to be these enchantments: uh, fairies jubilee, creme brulee. Displacer beef. We got a little smoked gorgon over here. We got a heart of flame. These are there's gonna be five of these up at a time, and these are sort of you know sort of a quest where you're going around town and you're collecting mm-hmm. uh, for to make creme brulee. You have to collect these ingredients, mm-hmm. and then it has a store, it has shop type that it wants. So the bakery wants to learn how to do this. So on any given turn, instead of collecting things, you can instead skip all the collecting and just instead pay the resources for your enchantment, 
and then you get the reward in the corner. So this is the six, six reputations. Yep. Then you slide it under the card, and now the store makes more bread, bread okay. or just any or item. whatever it is. But yeah. it has to match, so this will this oh, okay. will be making lots of bread. And then the other part about the enchant turn is you get to fire every dragon in the shop. So Ooh. now all three of these will do their thing, and you choose which order you want that to happen. You're okay. fired. <laughs> <laughs> Not like that. <laughs> they activate their. You're lighting flame. up. You're lighting up. You're lighting yeah. up. Yes, yeah. and whatever you want. And that's basically it. You're going to have this. Uh, you know, you're, you're going to take turns either going and gathering or enchanting until one of two things happens. This is how the game ends. Mm -hmm. If we run out of dragons, person who triggered it, everyone has one more turn, including them. So everyone will have one more turn. If we run out of enchantments, same thing. Person who triggered it, everyone will have one more turn, including them. Okay. And then we'll tally up our hidden goals, our fancy dragons, and we'll see who was the best flame keeper in town. Okay. All right. It sounds fun. Yeah. All right, it's good. Now let me get the deck set up so I can deal out some dragons mm -hmm. and then deal out a hidden goal. And we're yes, please. Get some dragons. All right. Hopefully we get... I imagine that uh, I will be winning this game, <laughs> and you guys will all be playing in my game. This is <laughs> my world, my dragon world. Yeah, interesting. Crystal Dragon says no. <laughs> Maybe so, next time. <laughs> I'm going to shuffle up the dragons and give everybody four dragons. And whoever gets the toast toast dragon Let's go first. will be going first. Okay. okay. So you can toast everybody else. <laughs> <laughs> if anyone wants to make a like, sourdough starter, real. I think, we'll be going first or something. So we'll see who gets toast. Okay. We are actually going to have some fun on the Kickstarter. We're going to vote who gets to be the starting dragons. Because what mm -hmm. it's going to be is uh, six starter dragons. And we'll just have a fun time voting who gets to be the starter. It might not be toast, but okay. for now it's toast. Did I, get, did I, I got toast. toast. I got oh, toast. There you go. should have let me one toast. Yeah, the name actually. The, oh, oh, the okay. name. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so you have a red dragon, but you don't have toast. I see what you're saying, yeah. So, I've got okay. the dragons right okay. here. We've got some uh, enchantments out in town. And we've got six different and then shops. That we can there are six starter shops, one for each of the types. Just... And oh. Callie has the first move to oh. go somewhere in town. Okay, I think I need to get some resources first. Right? That's right. This, yeah. yeah. We don't have anything yet. Okay. Right. And I should mention... Everything is super prototype. I mean, <laughs> we're very lucky that Sandara's art. That looks great. Say, for this being prototype, this looks really looks, good. Looks amazing. But yeah, I, I love just, this art we're, style. We're changing things and we're fixing things. And for the for today, I have some of the. I've crudely painted some of the toast, <laughs> but <laughs> but once we're out of the good stuff, we're down to cubes. So you know, okay. we're, we're it's hey. you know, mixed. Okay. So you have to move uh, your dragon there. Yeah, move my dragon. Go into now Dunkin' Dragon. Now you get dragon. it for showing up. Now when you, so the start of your turn, right, your dragon's not on the board. Correct. Okay? The very and first turn. Take your dragon and place it on any shop you would like. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Except for, yeah, on subsequent turns it cannot be a shop that you were already at. You okay. move. Okay. Yeah. And then you are going to gain. gain every, you're going to get an item. Yep. To the shop. Do there. I want this? You can take a there nice, there's nice the same. <laughs> then you have an option of placing a dragon. dragon. Okay, I would like to place toast on here. Okay, so she's going to put toast in the middle. Now, when you place oh, wait, this... one more thing, sorry. Yep. I have to give everybody a starting fancy tool. Okay. Oh, now, okay. when you okay. place your dragon, the requirements are these these three here. Mm -hmm. That indicates the types of dragons that can go there. Okay. But I'm going to give everybody two... And so this requires to have a bread dragon, uh, a meat... Or, or, or a meat. Or yeah. meat. And then the symbol here is, is to reward? draw more Get fancy, a fancy dragons. Now, I'm going to give everybody two fancy dragons. You're going to look at these and pick, pick one, one to be your yeah. starter. Sorry, I forgot that part. Did you have a These are cool. I like the colors. <laughs> the fancy dragons are all about the color, you know? Heck yeah. And that's actually, fancy, the, right? that's actually the dragon mini that people can win with the puzzles. Ooh. It's a fancy dragon. Okay. Okay, I'll take I this. I gotta get on that. And then this guy goes to the bottom, basically. And then you put it on the bottom, the one you don't want. Okay. And there you go. on, but Callie is going to take another one because she just put toast on the fancy yeah. dragon slot, so then you draw another card. And for most of these starter locations, uh, to place your dragon, it's typically going to be requiring a dragon so, of, of that oh, type. Okay. So for instance, oh I don't know, this is a meat, right? Is that what we're calling it? Yeah. yeah. Uh, the meat shop, the Draco Bell, right? Yeah. Uh, this place always gives me uh, flaming 
Uh, well, <laughs> never mind. But Draco, a little different maybe than, than what I'm used to. But uh, mm-hmm. this will require uh, it's new magic. dragons. The dragons do not give any heartburn. Oh, that's nice. It's yeah. the best cooked meat. Okay. I don't know if you well, meant heartburn, but something like that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <It's terrifying. laughs> there's no ill effects of the dragon cooked meat. So yeah, okay. but there's going to be more likely uh, spaces that dragons with a share a similar type to the right. location right. Right. to go to. When you see the tavern come out, did, say yes. it serves up a lot of different resources, but. So now you get to fire a dragon. Yes. So and now fancy. I get to fire up the dragon. Right. And draw. The so are they going to be so selected? So five dragons out. Okay. Okay. I'm going to put five out here. Okay. Oh, good. We got the Oh, there's a lot of potions hey, so and a lot of crystal, crystal right now. Ooh, welcome, welcome. Okay. You can also draw off the top of the deck. We are playing the game Flamecraft by mm-hmm. Cardboard Alchemy. All right. You got to go by name now. Show them up here. Okay. Cosmo looks pretty cute. Okay. All right. And the Sony Dragon will come out. So I yeah, imagine. what ha- would happen is it would go like this till the end of her turn because there are combos that will happen in this game. We'll let More you dragons can come out. Okay. Okay. So be you're done because there's no shot power. Then that's and it. you've done all of your things. All right. So now I'm going somewhere. Now all the right. only place I can't go is the bakery because when you go somewhere you have to pay an item and I don't have anything yet so I can't go over mm-hmm. there. When you go somewhere, you have to pay an item. If you go to if the somebody's same, there already. If you visit the same place. And the item you have to have to pay is based is, on is any. Okay. Any, any item you like. like. Okay. Well, I don't have anything today, so I'm gonna go over to Hello Nursery. Hello. And we'll put so I get a plan. Is this a take on the Animaniacs? <laughs> I don't know. Manny Manny would be able to answer that question. Hello Nurse. I feel like it is. <laughs> So like I went there and I got a plant because when you show up, you get the yes. free samples. I got that, and then I would like to put mulch in. The, I'll do the same thing that Kelly did, put in the uh, center one there. Really? So what that does is I get to draw a fancy dragon. Let's see what it counts. You sir, yeah. move where I wanted to go and place your card where I wanted to place oh, the card. Oh no! Dang it. <laughs> so now when you fire a uh, plant dragon, it's to give an item to any other player. And gain two reputation. So since Josh felt bad about that, I will do this. You can have a plant, uh, and then I'm gonna I get on the board. That. Okay, thank you. <laughs> there we go. So, so it's competitive, but there's is, also some mutual yeah, there's a little moves. bit of interaction yeah. in some of the powers. So uh, there's no shop power at that starter, and so that's it. I'm done. Okay. We're on to the Iron Dragon. Where would okay. you like to go? So I would like to go to the Draco Bell. I okay. was talking about it enough, and I normally can't yeah, the other location, so this one seems like a good one. Um, so I go there, I get a, I get a meat, yeah. right, I gain all the listed benefits, and then I'm right. going to get to place a dragon. So I could place something like a hot dog here. You could. And when I place hot dog down, um, I'm going to get a fancy dragon. Which right. I just draw one of these uh-huh. guys. Just draw one of those. And, okay. Yeah. And then it says, I get a well, fire. No. So yeah, this is a little bit old, this text, but the way the hot dog works is you get to place another dragon. Okay, but I don't gain, get. I don't get. I do gain. You gain the rewards listed on the slot that you place that dragon. Okay. So you could put it on another fancy slot. You could put it on somewhere where you're getting reputation. And reputation is the the hearts. Other hearts. So basically, they, that's what I want to have at the end of the game. Exactly. Whoever has the most is the winner. Correct. Okay. And then the other option is this little symbol that says one. That's which a is, coin. It's a gold coin. One gold. And I can use gold coins, coins uh, as, as points or as any item. Would you say that a fancy dragon is probably the way to go? Uh, it is a, it's Perfect. one of the, so there's a couple different ways to play. One of them is to go and do enchantments. Another way is to get fancy dragons. And then some of the shop powers are going to have other ways to turn things in for points. Uh. And of course, you could do a blend. Uh, Manny, the designer, loves the fancy dragon strategy. So what we're all doing right now is his usual okay. MO. I like to go the points usually, but. Um, you can okay. only gain... No, this is an older oh, one. Okay, so what okay. we're doing now, we're letting them eat dragon go everywhere. It's okay. far less... Yeah, that's uh, exactly what he said. So, so you go there. Place silver scale there on the Smith Mart, and allowing me to get another fancy dragon. And so basically, one of these guys might say, I have to be on um, an even uh, location here at the end of the game. And if right. I am, I'll get points, which you right. probably know okay. which one I actually have. Yes, exactly. Um, <laughs> but there are other ones that will let me do different things based on their requirements. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I perform my shop ability, which is nothing, but there are shops in the game that will come out. These are yes. the starting shops, the starting but there ones. are ones that will come out that will have a unique fancy ability, right? right. Okay. Um, so I'm going to pass. I'm done. Okay. okay. 
Well, since, like I said, Peter actually moved where I wanted to go and placed on the you exact spot there, I wanted to. You can go there, just handing the plant back. I'm, I'm, I'm going to change that up a little bit. I'm going to head over here to the classy knoll. Remember, when you had Hawk, you need to talk here, because otherwise, like I said, it and, uh, I'm, going, I'm then going to place Jasmine on the middle slot there, so I'm using the potion one. So, so I get, get a crystal when you show up, first of all. Yeah. Get a crystal. Thank you. Then you're placing on the. Now, do I have? Well, I've also got ways for placing no. the dragon there. No, no. only when I first show my character. Go in there. Right. Um, so I place Jasmine. The, her ability then activates first. Well, that so I get. first you get the fancy for yeah. going here. Okay. And um, now you activate fire. Okay. Jasmine. The, then that activates her ability, which is let, you know, let me swap with something in the in the, the park. So okay. Jasmine's gonna head to the park, and now. Deathfang has a job over here, <laughs> and I get to activate Deathfang's ability as well, Correct. which means I gain three different items then. Yep, that's what the Crystal Dragons do, you get uh, okay. three different items. I'm going to diversify a bit, I'll get a piece of bread, a piece of meat, and um, actually you know what, I'll go iron. for a piece of iron, yeah. just to diversify a bit. Okay. Okay, so then that shop doesn't have a power either, so you're all done. We're back yep. to Cali, and you have right. to move from the bread store, but you can go anywhere else. Yep, I'm going to go from the bread store over to Potable Potion. And she's able to go to any any shop. It doesn't it's even matter. Like a, it's even if a, there's a dragon there. It doesn't matter I, the length of distance, and it also doesn't matter if there's a dragon currently present in the location either. But if you go somewhere where somebody else is, you have to pay them. Correct. Yeah. You um, get a potion for going there, because yeah. it's the shop listed yep. resource. And then I would also like to play Cosmo here. She's going to play Cosmo in the first spot, which has two hearts, which means she's on the board with two reputations. So that will net her two bonus points. Yep. And then I will swap Cosmo with a dragon in Let's town search. or in the park. Correct. Um, let's get... So, well, wow, that's fine. Mm. Yeah, yeah around. hopping around, <laughs> job hopping. <laughs> so and now you get to do the crystal dragon's power. They have to be three different ones. Three different ones. So I'll get a crystal, I'll get a potion, and a leaf. All right. Where would I like wow, to you guys have go a lot next? Of now, things. what I'm going to start looking at if I want to do these is that um, now this particular one is pears. So the smoked gorgon, you can turn in one bread and one uh, iron for nothing. That You might only do that if you want to fire all the dragons. But if you turn in ah. two pear three pair or four pair it starts get getting better and better heart. these other Reputation. ones some of them have a dragon you get a dragon if you fulfill the enchantment okay. so i might be looking at these thinking okay uh you have to look at the store you might want to go as well because when you go to the store you're going to get to enchanted so i might say oh maybe i'll try and fill up the store that i'm eventually going to go to now um how do you gather dragons uh if I only have two and you all have more, is that because I have to draw any dragons in my turn or only so, the abilities? Red dragons are the main way to get dragons. Yeah. If you were ever feeling low on dragons, you go visit your friends, the bread dragons. Okay. Either by going on a gather turn and firing just one of them or on an enchant turn where there's maybe multiple bread dragons, you can get a bunch. Okay. You can also get, bread, you can get dragons by doing the enchantments that have a dragon symbol. They'll net you a dragon from the park. Right. And then finally, some shops that come up are going to be that dragon game type. Okay. So, if you're short, go visit a bread dragon. In fact, I'm going to take up that own, my own advice on that. Now, when I go there, I get a bread for going there and toast hands me a bread as well. Okay. So, I have okay. two of those. I can place a dragon, so I'm also going to take another bread dragon there. So, if Loaf joins the team, then I'll take two points for that. Toast and because Loaf. Because you place on the dragons. location that has two, two victory points on it. Correct. And I can fire either dragon, they're the same. So they allow me to gain a dragon from the park. I'm going to take this crystal dragon. And then a new one that's going to come out face down at the end of your turn. That's my turn's over, so now we can turn it up. It's rusty. So we've got a couple of iron dragons and a couple of potion dragons in town. Okay. Wow. Okay. All right. Is there any way I'm going to be able to flame more than one dragon on my turn? Enchant. You can do an enchantment. The dragons love when you make them magical. When you make the shops uh, all special with more stuff. And I would have to be on a location, mm -hmm. right? I would have to pay for one of these guys. Mm -hmm. That matches that location. Mm -hmm. So if you're going to do it shop. here, you need you to do, do that, that one or that one. And then I would add the enchantment card to the, sh add the, enchantment card to the shop and gain a list of awards. So right. I'd take this and put it over here. Right. And then I would get the rewards for this. And then I could mm -hmm. activate all the dragons there. Right. Okay. 
But I don't have a lot of uh, I don't have a lot of ingredients. You gotta go get right some now. stuff. Resources, yeah. yeah. Uh, crystal dragons or are, crystal dragons are a really good way to get yeah. resources. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So yeah, that's I'm actually gonna go. I think over here, okay, to the Hello Nursery, uh-huh. and that's gonna net me two of these guys. Two plants. And, and then, then you can make a you know meat and a veggie dish over there. And then I am going to place a dragon, and I'll go ahead and place this bread dragon over here, okay. which will give me a gold coin. All right, you got a wild. And then I can go ahead and flame on one of these guys. Flame on! Right. Uh, so I can give an <laughs> item to another You're player to gain him. two points, so I can draw a dragon from the park. And I think I want to draw a dragon from the park. I only have one dragon left. Okay, so you're getting more another dragon. Ah, uh, sadly. Or I... off the top of the deck. Okay, because I don't know if I want those ones. Let me see. Don't take offense, Rusty. He doesn't mean it. Getting two <laughs> items of the shop or dragon type here. Yeah. Uh, it's not a get bad two of the kind idea. Actually, I will take this one here. Shale has been picked up, and we've got another a plant dragon up here. All right, and that's going to end my turn. Correct. Okay. Well, um, well I actually was considering so there's a ton of dragons in this game. Peter is, but actually I'm going to switch it up. I'm going hey, to go to Smith. The street. Welcome, okay. welcome. We're playing uh, I'm Flintcraft. going to place Flint down here and get okay. two hearts. Well, before you do that, oh, you're going to get, your you're okay. gonna get uh, an iron and you're going to get a crystal. Silver scale also oh, okay. hands you a free uh, crystal upon entry and then okay. you place Flint. Placing him there then gets me the two hearts. Two, so yeah, you're on the board. Mm-hmm. And then you can yeah. fire either of these dragons. And then I'm going to fire Silver scale okay. and then get a leaf. An iron. Okay. It's and loaded with stuff I don't know what you're talking about. Just because I'm a dragon <laughs> yeah. and I hoard things, I mean, yeah. you know. This is a good time to mention there is a limit on resources. Oh. You can okay. have seven of each type. So you can have seven okay. iron, okay. seven meat. So you got you got plenty seven. of time. Okay. Yeah. yeah. And you can only hold bad. six dragons. In I'm case sure it'll start okay. getting more and more yeah. 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 up here. Yeah. So. Okay. Then I am done. Alright. The crystal dragon is okay, running around crystal to... crystal dragon going over to the classy... Remember, Kelly. Classy, no. No. Speak here. Okay. I can hear you. <laughs> <laughs> the gla- I'm going to the glass shop. This made it easiest and... for me because I just talked. Yeah, <laughs> that's why I oh, want you there. Before you do that, oh, what happens yeah, when you show up? I get up? my resources. Yeah. Both of them. Yeah. You get two things. There you go. Crystal and a potion. All right. I like this one. Mm. And then... Opal Wing is going to come out here mm-hmm. and give me two points. Hey, you're catching up. <laughs> 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 and also lets me gain three different items. Yeah, you could um, activate Cosmo. Or, I, nah. Yeah, but I if you like Opal I like, Wing. I like getting some resources right now. Sure. I'm getting one of these, one of these, and uh, another one of these. <laughs> what is she working on? She's got all these potions. She could be, she could be mm-hmm. doing that. Could be maybe in the curb, maybe some curb We yeah. don't know. Okay, and so that's it. My turn. Let's see. I kind of want to fill a shop so I can get this party going. But We're pretty close on a few. Occupied, yeah. The, so there are three shops now with two dragons. Four of them. One more. Ah, four. Oh, yeah. One here and then all across that side mm-hmm. of the board. Right. I can't go to the one I'm at. I just happen to have. So you had to have the right dragon for the resource show and then place uh, it there. You know what, this seems like a good one to do, perhaps. So I'm going to go over here to Smith Park. You can I'm have a they, piece of bread. <laughs> uh, now I get to get two iron and a crystal. Very nice. Go in there. Yeah, it gets a lot when you have more dragons there. Right, mm-hmm. absolutely. And yeah. then I'm going to place Jewel Heart in this there you spot go. to get a gold coin. Then I'm going to fire off jewel hearts here so we're gonna get a one more iron and Do you anything else kind of like a bread okay and then a plant okay let's do that so then uh nothing else happens there's no power but there are three dragons so a new shop comes out okay and i have these things in the way so we just move any of these so we'll just this one out of the way down there in front of you okay. and okay. tip the scales is our mm-hmm. new shop a tip of scales is a uh, crystal store. I guess they make some D&D rings or whatever they make. And nice. their power <laughs> at the end is you can pay two crystal to convert unique items one-to-one into reputation. So if you have okay. a set of six, you can turn in all six and get six points. 
After okay. you pay two crystals. After you pay two crystals. Yeah. Or you could pay two crystals and just turn in a bread, a plant, uh, and an iron and get three points. So there's so something you can do. potentially a point engine store. And exactly. the benefits of putting dragons here are a little different, too. Oh, sure, bigger. you've got, you've got three bigger. reputation there. This one is a wild, oh, so right. any dragon can go there. Okay. okay. All right. But that was my turn. That was pretty protective. Uh, wow. Okay. Now, even if I can't place a dragon down, that's okay. You can still collect resources I and fire can. somebody up. Right. I, if I go over here, I have to give Callie something, right? Correct. Yep. I have to give her one of my... Any my... resource you want. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Okay, I will give her this. Okay. Thank you. I like that. <laughs> and then I'm going to go together ahead items. and get two of those. Yep. yep. And one potion. Mm -hmm. All right, and then I get to activate one of the dragons. I can't place, sadly. Okay. Uh, so I'm going to activate the one that gives me three resources. Sure. Okay. Activate Opa Wing. <laughs> <laughs> Opa Wing's very up. happy. Yeah, Opa Opa Wing's making stuff. And yeah. one oh, yeah. more. I love all the names. Crystals are really versatile. The the crystal dragons. Uh, the thing is, is that they like to have official dragon names. Mm -hmm. That's why there's Death Fang. I mean, yeah. it's really yeah. funny yeah. that the that cool. crystal dragons are all serious. They just they want the actual. Mm -hmm. And you know, classic I am names. done. I'm gonna pass. Uh, this game is gonna be on a Kickstarter, okay. uh, August 10th. Correct. August I'm 10th. To it. Um, and yeah, this is uh, Peter's second game, Flamecraft, uh, made uh, designed by Manny Vega. Mm -hmm. um, with artwork wonderful by art. Sandra. Right? Sandara. 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 Yep. Wonderful art. Wonderful Sandara game, happens yeah. to be a, uh, she's a dragon expert. She makes uh, really? dragons for gamer mats, for Blizzard, for Wizards of the Coast, for I wonder if I have some of her art already. Like, if you've seen an amazing dragon online, you've probably hard. seen her art. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, these are the, just sort of the... the little tiny artists of dragons she was uh, doodling on Instagram. So, we're very no, lucky yeah, to have them in our game. Uh, okay, I'm going to be the first player to enchant the place. So first, I'm going to move here. I'm okay. going to gather my three pieces of bread. A, if you're going to enchant, though, you're not going you to gather. Oh, that's right. Right? Okay. I don't need so to gather. So if good. you're going to do a, a you're good. going to perform an enchantment. Yep. So I'm actually going to get fairies jubilee. Okay. So, so here you're going are to my pay two three, leaves. Two leaves. And my three there. iron. Whoops. There you go. And then we're going to slide this under the store. But before we do so, you get like four, four yes, reputation. Please. There we go. And a dragon of your choice. Um, and then you can slide that another turn. I think I'm going to take the lotus. Okay. Now, here's what I'm I get to fire both of them, you right? You do. You get to activate both those dragons. So which is I can't more take the one closer face down, but right. yeah, I'll, I'll just take one of each. So I'll take Jasmine and Rusty. All right. And there we go. And that's and it. And there's no power, so we flip them up. Yep. Now we've got, forward. got a Good. variety in the park now. Nice job. You've Thank enchanted you. the town. Okay. Now that you could go to the there and get uh, a lot Even of more bread. bread. That's right. Yeah. Fairy Jubilee. And this all flips the over and then. flips okay. over as well. Now you can make the Joe, Joe Forgeman. <laughs> so this is for each pair these of these, I can net what, zero, two, four, and eight points. Right. Mm -hmm. So you want to do two pairs at least. Yeah, at least two pairs. Now, you, the reason why you can do just one pair is that what if you just want to activate the dragons and you don't care necessarily about the points? Or also, you can also put this on the shop and it will generate you right. more resources. Sure. Okay. I'm... I guess I'm going over to Dunkin' Dragons as well. Okay. I'm making resources. <laughs> <laughs> it's day old donut because, that she does I'll take yeah, you. <laughs> yeah. Because I want to enchant as well. Oh, the creme brulee is yeah, coming out. Yeah, we now want this creme brulee. creme brulee is actually one of Sandara's most famous pieces. It's a little creme brulee dragon roasting a creme brulee at the table. Oh, that is so, so the waiter's yeah. just got the creme brulee dragon out just roasting the creme brulee so right cool. in front of you. So we had to put it in there. So she's making uh, a creme brulee right now. So we got three... Herbs there, two yeah. potion, and, and a crystal. The crystal, the crystal makes it taste the best. Yeah. <laughs> yeah you get six that. reputation for that. Yes. yes. That's pretty good. Okay. Going from four all the way up here to ten. Now he's in the lead. Okay. And you get to fire both dragons, which in this case is more dragon draw. Yes. Yeah. All right. Okay. Ooh, I think I want... You get smoky, moonbeam, all kinds of stuff. Smoky. All right. And... Elderberry. <laughs> moonbeam. Moonbeam from Moonshell. <laughs> yeah. I like a moon. Oh, basil. I like right. it. And blossom. Yeah. Okay. 
Okay. Well, you guys enchanted the one that I was kind of looking at. <laughs> I was like, mm, you can come fast. No, I have now. I have different resources, so now we're okay. gonna work on something else. Well, you can move there and give me a coin. I'm fine. Hey. I mean, if I go there and pay you stuff, I still get a ton of bread. So oh, yeah. much bread. Uh, which actually oh, yeah. is tempting. You, you know what? Which you have a lot of. Uh, I so know. Do, you, do you pay go both of us, or yes, just one I have of us? to pay both of you. Okay, I, I'll take the coin, please. Yeah. Uh, no. <laughs> sure. Have the really? plant, and you're gonna have the crystal. <laughs> Thank you. And we're having a party. And, yeah. uh, boy, that's five bread for going there. The We're getting donut wasted, heck yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and now I'm going to fire, well, I can place a dragon. Don't have one to place, but I can yeah. fire one Does of those. meat left in that slime. Loaf, effect. my good friend. Who are we going to get? Let's get another plant dragon. Okay. Let's get basil. All right, and we got coal. That's going out. Back to Michael and the... I'm Iron trying to coin. I'm hoping. If you <laughs> want to join the party to take a dragon <laughs> and pay oh, three resources, do you, do you have to? Yeah. Uh, no, I am going to <laughs> enchant. Oh, we're okay. going to uh, Which one? Oh, can I enchant the place I'm at? No, you have, you have to, to move, move every turn. Oh, I thought I had to be on that space to enchant. No, I do. You, you do. have to move to start right. your turn. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oops. You'll have to come back. Yeah. So I can't actually enchant. Not this round. Well, you can enchant something else. Okay, no, nobody to, has that one. I wanted no, to I enchant. Well, I mean, yeah, the problem is there's a, there is another crystal store, but there's no dragons there. So it's a yeah. little less exciting to do an enchantment. Right. Like now. you wouldn't get the benefit out of it, so. I, well, I would get anyway. this benefit. I just yes. wouldn't get to. Like mm -hmm. fire everything. Yes. Yeah. So I would go do something else and come back. Yeah. It doesn't look like anyone else is close to that one. So. Shoot. Right. right. You're not going to be. Yeah, we're not going to get ahead on that oh, one. Well, Serge, I hear you. Like lately. The pledge managers have been draining my bank account so hard. <laughs> right, so I'm, I'm gonna go over to here. Money, get married, so it's like that will net me two of these okay. guys here. Okay. Games, wedding. Then games, I'm gonna go ahead wedding. and place uh, games. Shorty Definitely here. Games. So it lets me place another <laughs> dragon points. out. Well, two and, points. And first. it also gives me two points. Okay. So it'll get me on the board Good here board. for once. Nice. And then I'm gonna go ahead and place Shade here, which will give wow. me. Uh, well, will someday give me two items uh, from other shops of different dragon types, but it will give me a coin, coin. instead. For That's a good combo. And so that also opens up another, another shop, shop, right? Yep. So we'll move this over. Yeah. So I think we can cycle these down a little bit. Okay. And then we've got the flagons and dragons. Flagons right. and I dragons. Like it. So that's one that nobody on our it. nobody on our Facebook oh, group yeah. has seen yet. So this is a tavern that we're working on. I like it that. has a wild symbol on there, which means that any resource Wait, no, can be like chosen that? when you go there. They were one over, okay. I think. Okay. Any okay. resource can be chosen when you go there, and it also means any enchantment can be done there. Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, and the power says pay one gold coin to fire all the dragons there on a gather turn, or wow. gain a gold coin for every dragon that's there. So one or Both the other. Pretty yeah. solid. Wow. Mm -hmm. That's a popular place. So, yeah, the dragon pub is where it's at. Right? <laughs> I love the it's fact a party. that, I it's mean, a party. I There's love the fact that, that he looks, yeah. this dragon looks a little bit like Snoopy. I mean, it looks like, like a, just <laughs> listening to the adventurers come in yep. and tell their tales. And Well, yeah, there's another one over here cooking. There's another one carrying dishes. Yeah. yeah. It's so cool. <laughs> All right. So, so that was, that was, that was the end of his turn. Okay. Yeah, so you're up. Oh, I got, I got drawn into everything else. I didn't think about my turn. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what do I want to do? Yeah, I need to. Oh. Oh, I have a question about this then for one yeah. of my fancy dragons later, maybe, but okay. I'm not going to worry about that quite yet. You know what? I'm going to move to tip the scales. Okay. And I'm Get going to. Get a crystal to... for going there. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Yep. I'm going to gather, of course, and then I'm going to place a plant dragon, herb, the one you saw me pull, down here. Okay. And get a fancy. fancy. I think the fancy is where it's at. They are pretty <laughs> good. I can start working on my fancy dragons. Yeah, that tells me what I need to go start is doing. This, okay, this. I'm oh, a okay. little confused on the, the mechanic. Does this happen at the end of the game, or can so I do this I will whenever? tell you. I forgot to mention that there are some that are marked with an exclamation point. Okay. Which is the which is not end game. It is a whenever Ongoing. you have it done okay. on your turn. Reveal. If you yeah, if you've met the condition, you flip that one over and that. that Can I only do it once? Yes, only one oh, time. Okay. Okay. But those are uh, not okay. end game. Those so are like my fancy. Yeah. Uh, I place a dragon. Uh, I fire the dragon one. that I just placed. So give an item to another player and gain two hearts. 
I appear you've been very generous, and oh. I heard you like day old donuts. I so mean, I do. Look at this a pile of bread that I've got going <laughs> And I'll get two hearts. So you have <laughs> seven already. I have so seven. can you even oh. give that to you? So you can give oh, that to me. At the end of my uh, turn, I'm not allowed to have more than seven, so I will have to okay. lose the day old bread. And or they, spend it. Yeah, or, or spend it, which okay. is what I'm going to do. Okay. okay. Cool. All right, my crystal dragon going back over to the potion shop. Okay. And I'm going to get a potion and a crystal. Perfect. And I will play Dandelion here and get fancy. special dragon there. All these fancy dragons. I need to get them. Mm -hmm. it's, it, I don't have the most fancy dragons and I'm behind, so now I'm like not <laughs> liking this. So okay, I, now I have to this. give an item to another player to Gain two. No. <laughs> oh I was hoping. <laughs> I was hoping. <laughs> and you're all done, yes. right? What, what place are you in? Where are you on the on the board? No, no. What, what, oh. You're yeah. You're but well, I'm right here. Right. <laughs> so I am going to go over and visit uh, this yeah, one. Coins, I'm gonna right? say hello and give you a bread. Oh, there you go. Because I went to the same shop as you. I'm going to enchant Draco yeah. Bell with a little smoked gorgon. That's what nice. I'm going to serve there right now. Okay. Uh, it's fancy. pairs of uh, bread and iron. Yep, so I happen so. to have three iron, but I've used a gold coin. The most the you can one. do is okay. four pairs, though, right? Correct. Oh, okay. so you're going to rack them nice. So I am going to here. turn in four pairs to get eight points. And you're what color? Are you white? No. Nope. No. I am green. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Ooh. Okay. Takes We're going to mark the player rates, too, with Takes colors, so you can have the one in front of you that's your color. Uh -huh. Okay. Um, so I did that, and then I get to activate all these dragons in the shop. So I don't I don't get to see that yet since oh. my turn's not over. Yes, yeah. this matters. I'm going to place two other dragons. Activate Shorty here. Place something. So oh, wow. we're gonna okay. put this one over here for two points. One two. Yep. yep. Then we're gonna put uh, this one over here for a gold coin. That's gonna fill another shop. Cool. And then this last one is Shale, which can get either two meat or two iron. I am going to choose meat because we haven't seen. It. There we go. Enough of those. Drake yes. of Cakes. I love it. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> and the Drake of Cakes one allows you to pay two bread to get two dragons from the park. So it's a great way to get more dragons. Oh, okay. All right. Fill up your hand. Here we go. And that's my turn. All right. I love so now, I'm so back in this game. Now I am going cool. to it's move like my character here. here. <laughs> I'm going to enchant now. Uh, if we were all smart, we would have walked over there so that when he enchanted, we would have all gotten something. <laughs> well, then I could have went to uh, this one over here That's instead. Because we knew yeah. he was going to... Three yeah, okay. and two, I believe. And I put these guys back. I don't really want to spend my coin, but... Sometimes you got to do it. I just did it. Yeah. And then I get this Heart of Flame here. Mm -hmm. Which well, will spending go... your coin will let you, you know, overall... So give me another points, dragon so. from the park, right? And, and four, four points. points. I'll get your, your, your point. What do I want? Reputation. What do I want? I'm going to need this this one here, I think. Honey, honey. Okay, and then I'm going to be able to uh, fire all the dragons. That's correct. So You've I got, get... In any order that you'd like, and because there's potion dragons there, this could get... I mean... I'm going to steal these happen, and yeah. look at them really quick. Sure. Okay, so I've got the ability to gain three different items. Right. She's swap got a dragon. with a dragon in town or park, and then use its fire. And swap with a dragon in town or park. Okay, so they're both so the same. All the all the dragons of a certain type are the same. Okay. I think we'll go with. I can do the three different. The items is a good place to start. You know, get that done. Yes, I agree. Um, Especially because the potions could be the same thing, really. So I'm going for a potion. Okay. All right. I'm going for a bread. So when you've got potion that, dragons okay. at a shop, mm -hmm. his choices are going to be, I mean, he could turn both those potion dragons into crystal dragons and get about nine items. Mm -hmm. He could turn those potion dragons into bread dragons and get more dragons. If he had a hand of dragons, he could turn those potion dragons into meat dragons and then play those dragons. So there's a lot of things you can do with the potion dragon. Crystal. They give me three okay. more. Mm -hmm. Items of my cho of my choosing. As long as they're different, though, right? Correct. Yeah. If you wanted same, you'd switch with a iron dragon. Okay, so we're gonna go for another bread. I'm gonna go for a green. Mm -hmm. And I'll go for. What else do I want? 
I like a coin, but I can't have that. <laughs> you guys to go for um, there are fun shops meat. for that though. Mm-hmm. And then this guy here. I mean, you can actually get coins at the tavern. So. Hmm. I think I'll just take another dragon from the park. Okay. All right. And I think I want. Mm, who do I, I want? I like the pushing dragons getting out of town. I think I'll I like take. To see. I like to see. I think I'll take Blossom here. There are shortest of meat dragons on the field. <laughs> there's only two meat dragons working right now. And that's yeah. it for me. Yeah. Okay. And there's one in the park. It's oh, a fancy hey, turn hey. there. Okay. My turn, I got. I might have a couple questions here. We'll okay, see. Okay, sure. Okay, I'm going to move to the Smith Mart and enchant. Okay. So first up, I'm going to spend the two. I'm actually getting George Foreman. I'm okay. sorry, Joe, oh. uh, Joe Forgeman. And you're only sorry. doing it for one pair, which is yeah, no reputation, right? Okay. Okay. I'm fine with that. Okay. But, uh, what I'm more worried about is that now I get to flame each of these dragons. Correct. So if I flame Flint first, I mm-hmm. get plus two, and I add that on to Jewel Heart, how does that work? So no, the way that Flint works is you're going to get two of a kind, and it can be either the shop type, which is iron, or any oh, dragon's type. Oh, so it means two jewels then. So you get two crystal if you did Jewel Heart. Or, yeah, crystal rather, sorry. Yeah. So yeah, okay. you could use crystal potion or Slap iron when you standard. fire Flint here. Okay. And the three ways the game ends is if all the dragons come out. So the dragon deck empties. Yep. The enchantment deck empties. Those are the two ways. Okay, those are the only two ways. Those are the only two ways. Uh, I suppose if you hit 14 shops, you could just call it. But we don't usually, you know, you you only get to about 12 or so, even in a five-player game. So. Okay. I'm going to first fire Flint and get plus two of himself. Well, he'll he'll choose. I you know you'll choose one of the resource types to get two of. Yeah. It's yeah. either yeah. So it's the same as the store. So okay. It works. Oh okay. Yeah. Um, then I'm going to activate Jewel Heart and okay. I'm going to get one plant, one potion, mm-hmm. and. What's done? I was collecting meat and then and I went actually one iron meat plant potion iron. What? Okay. And then I'm going to activate Cosmo and swap Cosmo mm-hmm. with Toast. Okay. Toast now works at the smithy. Yeah. So <laughs> Every time you make a new park, weapon, Toast is like, and I've got some uh, celebratory, uh, you know, uh, French toast for that. There we go. All right, so there's something over here. Empanadas is another thing you can make now. <laughs> Empanadas. <laughs> Empanadas. There we go. Exactly. I love the puns. You're either gonna love the puns, groan, and still love the puns. You know. Like they're total dad joke status. It's yeah. fun. All right, my combo is going here now. I'm not working. Sounds good. So. Let's go. Welcome. <laughs> We're gonna go over to back to Dunkin' Dragons to get a, a bunch Whole lot of, bread. of bread. Well, it's actually some potion now too. Because toast <laughs> left. <laughs> It's a, it's a bunch there. of bread and a drink. Bread works there. And a potion. <laughs> and then I will place Smokey down here. Okay, you get, you a, get coin. a coin. Okay. And you get to activate, uh, before she sees that, you she gets to activate yeah. one of those. Um, um, shop, I'm going to draw from the park, I think. Okay. I, need. I better get some. These dragons are going. They're all getting yeah. jobs. Down and I gotta get some more. Uh, cool. Good at some rest. <laughs> Alright, so then you got a dragon. Mm-hmm. And now uh, your turn's over. Yep. So we fill the shop, so a new shop's opening. Alright, and this Yay. one's called Bizarre Bazaar. The Bizarre Bazaar. <laughs> it's actually a board game called Bizarre Bazaar. <laughs> that one's a lot of fun. You can actually go there and reveal one of your end game fancy dragons, fi- flip it face up, and score it. And you still get to score it at the end of the game. Ooh. You can't do that with an exclamation one. It has oh, to be an okay. end game one. Gotcha. Okay. And as soon as it's face up, it stays face up to indicate that it can't be scored again. Okay. That one's very tempting. In fact, I might just have to run over there because it also has a fancy slot with an any on it, and I just need some more of these. <laughs> so when I go there, you can also select one of any resource. Yeah. So I am going to get a meat, and I will place... Basil right there. I gotta draw a fancy. Now, when I do that, I'm firing a dragon, so I'm gonna activate Basil, and you seem like you need more toast. Oh, thank you. Two points. <laughs> and now I get to do the power, and the power that I'm choosing to activate is. Venti says if town has at least four potion dragons, 
And it does. One, two, doesn't it? Oh, I thought you looked like a potion dragon. Only three. Never mind. Oh, Benji's, keep moving Benji's gonna come and we are short. <laughs> Oh, it seems like there's more because they keep moving. Yeah, we're not venting for Grande. <laughs> well, that's a sad turn. Now I'm not going to be able to do the, the power at the bazaar. Oh, little Venti, you disappointed me. All right, I'll just take my free resource and we'll we'll. Kyle's going to saying that uh, Texas is not that far from California, so she would like a prototype. <laughs> that's right. So Excellent. much hype for the game. All right. Not that far. <laughs> Half the country. <laughs> okay. All right. My turn now? Mm-hmm. Yep. All right. I went well, to the bazaar and they were closed. So now I need to go back. <laughs> this one's you, right? It is. Yeah, okay. Mm-hmm. I'm looking around here to see where I want to go. Mm-hmm. So. Mm, who's this? Red? Me. Okay, yeah. you're pretty far behind like if I you, am. You know, if you go to a shop and you don't place a dragon, but you're gathering... Can you still flame one of them? Yeah. Huh? Okay. I'm gonna yeah. go. I'm also okay. going to enchant cool. again. Oh really? And I'm gonna give Josh. Really? Smith Mart's getting. Well, you have to give me one shit. moving there. What? Yeah. You have to give me one moving there. That's what you're doing. That's what he's doing. Yeah. 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 We were saying something enchanting. I was like, well, I don't, I'm not involved with enchanting. I'm gonna give you this, and I want you to be quiet. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm going to go ahead Have and some meat. Now I'm not going to go ahead and craft. Yeah, I'm, I was handing you, and you're looking at me like you need to give me a thing. I'm like, what the hell are you talking about? Okay, so I am going to go there. Yes. I pay him because he exists there, and then I can pay my items, and I can make one of these two things here. Right. Correct. So I need a meat. I would need two. Two plant. plants working on the and pot these here. three. Okay. That, well, that, would make, that would be six, which is a good chunk. And I think All I right. That. right. It Maybe. doesn't give me an extra dragon, though, but I think I can get those later on anyway. Okay, and that's going to so, let me six points. He's right? enchanted the shop One, two, three, for six four, five, reputations. And six. And now all of the dragons are happy and are going to celebrate with him, and you can mm-hmm. fire these in any order. Okay, <laughs> so I can gain two items uh, of the shop or dragon type here. So I can choose either uh, bread, iron, iron bread. or the crystal. Okay. And what do I need? What do I want? I don't need the bread. I don't need the iron. I have all three. <laughs> the dragons can hear you, you know. <laughs> I don't need your stuff. So I think I'll just actually get one of each of. What are you doing, jewel hearts first then? Oh, is it being... This is two of a kind, so you have to choose the oh, same. Oh, two of the same. Yeah, when you're choosing right. the flint activation, it has to be the same. Okay, we'll just go but with for the, jewel heart. It's those different. Then I think. Okay, and now now I get to take a dragon from the park. Yeah, I can't believe that Benty we got to work on our timing. Oh. <laughs> I need. Uh oh. Uh oh. That's gonna be a challenge, I think. I'm just gonna take one of these guys here from the park. And then the last thing I can do is take three different uh, items. So I will take a green. I will take. With all the diversity of stuff he's got going on with it. Meat. And then one other one. Give me a hell of a sandwich. Trying to, <laughs> trying to, <laughs> and a drink to go with it. Get okay. all the different things. All right, and I think You're that's good? it for me. Yeah. This okay. Is tough. This well, is I'm tough. going to move to Duncan, or Duncan Dragons. Yeah. I'm going to give Callie uh, some iron. Thank okay. you. I'm going to enchant actually. Oh really? You're gonna put some info out. Yeah. So one thing to point out: there is a limit of enchantments on each shop of oh. three. Oh, okay. This is the last one at Dunkin' Dragons. Okay, I'm paying two of each resource. Thank you. Just, you uh, you're just trying to make uh, us score please. less points now, aren't you? No, you can and still go to you could you go to Are Flagons you? and Dragons. He's making up he's making up rules so that we don't win. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I'm going to put that over here. Get my two hearts from that. That's maxed out on <laughs> um, on um, the enchantments then. So I got the one face down over here. Okay. Oops. And now all the dragons activate. Okay, so I'm going to get one from the park. So Loaf is going right now. This was on Michael's turn, right? Yes. yes. So you have two iron. You have meat, iron, or potion. Or How many total of each different dragon are there? There are, in a four-player game, there are six. Six, six of each. Hmm. Um, you know what? I'm going to take Earl. Oh, no, there's seven of each in the... In the Seven. The next, I'm going to activate Cosmo and swap Cosmo with something else here. Running out. 
Yeah, I know. Six left. So dragons are feeling like Cosmo. I do want to get some hearts, but I don't know. Yeah, okay. <laughs> no. It's getting dangerous to give people hearts now, though. I'm going to swap with Hot Dog, actually. Alright. Activate Hot Dog now based on Cosmo's ability. Place a dragon and get said bonus without actually flaming the dragon. So I'm going to place Pumpernickel mm. and get three hearts. Nice. And then I'm going to activate Smokey and place another dragon. This is the way to do it. You get some reputation mm -hmm. by bringing dragons all over the place. You, you have a crystal dragon? No? I wish I did, yeah. yeah I was looking like Eddie. That's out. two points. <laughs> That's yeah, I think best. I can do you know, twos there, so... Right, can fill Look the tavern. Here, um, huh? Wow. I was debating what I want to ask because it gives away one of my fancy dragons. I'll that's wait fine. on that. Uh, if you get the one that place. says uh, you have to have a matching dragon at that shop, the wilds do not count for that. Okay. It has to be a Come on, AP. Thing. In that case, <laughs> I will place Skewer here uh, and get two, two hearts here. Yeah. And that's all three dragons flamed. I'm done. All right. Okay. Ooh. All right. I will go to Flagons and Dragons. Okay. <laughs> um, Place a dragon? You get one. Or you get, so you get a resource of your choice plus a meat and a, and a potion. Meat, potion, and crystal. Okay. 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 And then I'd like to place. Wait, when do. We, oh, I don't do that till later. You okay. don't do I that. Like the power is at the end. Coal for two points. Okay, another shop. And. I can do I can one dragon. Flagons of Dragons is one way to get coins, actually. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. It's a great way, currently. Three coins mm -hmm. right there. Oh, uh, yeah. I gave one of my favorites of Oregon is the uh, Wishing Well, where, yeah. you, where yeah. it starts with coins in it, and then you go there and you flip heads and tails. Heads, you leave coin. Tails, oh. you take the whole pot. Ooh. I love gambling yeah. type uh, <laughs> things like that. So. Push your luck a little bit. Yeah, yeah push your luck and yeah, I'll gain, your big pot or I'll gain hmm. coin. Alright, three coins. Dragon. That is a very good So choice. if you're the first one there, do you flip a coin and get a coin for free? Uh, no, it starts with two in the pot. Oh, okay. We might make that three in the pot. We're, see, we're gonna check that okay. out. That's it. Okay. okay. What to do? I need dragons. I need crystal. I got, oh, there's, there's <laughs> you need <shot>. everything. <laughs> Alright, we've got uh, the full plate buffet. Ooh. Another one that we haven't really shown, but what happens here is... You can pay a coin to get one of each item. You can fill up your plate with wow. like one of everything. Okay. Um, and That's it's got good. some other things, reputation to get there. And it's a meat. It's primarily a meat shop because you got a meat guy serving up. This is a chef. This is a chef dragon. Mm -hmm. I need to get crystal though for a couple things going on here. So I'll go there because someone enchanted it with the Heart of Flame that's got four, four. crystal and a bread. Does a wild mm -hmm. space mean you can put any enchantment there yes, too? Yes, it does. Okay. Any enchantment can go at the okay. bazaar well, or at me. the town. <laughs> so I got okay. my resources. I'm gonna choose one of those dragons to fire off and it's going to be a crystal dragon. I'm going to get another crystal and another bread. from over there. Got you covered. Okay. And I have done. I'll move here. I'm going to enchant. I'm going to... Well, you guys have certainly gotten the game. Just enchant. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm way behind. I no. gotta figure it out. Three. Two. Okay. One. It's like you play games on the stream or something. This is <laughs> over here. Score me six points. One, two, three, four, five, and oh, six. Oh, I got the lead. And all those giants and are And then activated. I'll activate. Mm -hmm. I'm going to give... What do you got? Nothing? Who's this? I have a bunch Me. of stuff. I have some stuff. Yeah. I have <laughs> Just a tiny amount of things. <laughs> <laughs> I'm boarding the crystal bread. Cool. So me. Appreciate it. And the other one is... I can swap a dragon in town or a park and then use its... So I swap with this guy then here. Anywhere in town, you can get a different dragon there. <sighs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, I forgot to draw my dragon for the bread guy. No, I, I didn't fire the bread. I fired the crystal. Yeah, yeah. Three yeah. different items. I'm doing this all wrong. 
spread potion and a gem. Done. Okay. Let's flip that over. New enchantments. I'm going to move here. Okay. There you go, Callie. Thank you. Give her your potion. Uh, I'm going to enchant. Okay. I'm going to grab the ironwood poppies. Okay. Paying two of each resource. All right. So. Oh, and once the deck empties, that's, that's when the game is. Does it end instantly? No, it's um, another round. Everyone gets one more turn, including the person who triggered it. Okay. Okay, so I get that. So I get two oh, I'm points for too. having I'm two pairs. Make it a super party, but you're sadly going to leave. Now I get to flame all three of these in any order. So I'm right. going to first. And I'm assuming since uh, Cole is here at the wild card station, I can grab two of any resource I want. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm going to grab two bread, please. Okay. There you go. Thank you. Next, I'm going to activate the uh, es espresso. espresso. Sorry, bring that upside down. No worries. Swap. But, um, yeah. And get whoever I want to move in. Where are crystals? Okay. Uh, yeah. I'll do crystal. So silver scale is now working in flag and dragons. I'm going to grab... Um, what do I need? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, that's a good no, shot. I need that. Um, a meat, a crystal, and an iron, please. Those are my three different ones. And then last but not least, I have Skewart. I get to place a dragon and then collect based on whatever the location is. Yep. Mm -hmm. I'm going to put Earl down over here and get another fancy dragon. Sure. So and can I start? That's it. One, two, three, All right. Four, five. Just making sure enough jobs can help. One, okay. two, three, four, five. Yeah, okay. I'm going over to the smith. My, oh, let's see what this yep. is. Yep, let's see what that is. No, good. I'm going to the Smith Mart and I'm going to enchant the Spellcast spell cast Iron. Nice. So, two three potions, bread, two potions. Mm -hmm. That'll give me four Let's points. Oh, it's tight. And now I'm at the back tied for the last. I don't like it. I don't like it. Um, don't get these done. Do I get from a park? Yep. Yeah. Okay. Oh, no. Wrong deck. Oops. Oops. No worries. And then. Thistle is going to swap in silver scale here. Okay. Nice. I and love that. Collect on that. Okay. And give me a That's great. That's great. crystal, That's a leaf, exactly what I like to say. and a meat. Thank you. Okay. And then toast is going to let me drop propane here. Mm -hmm. And Flint will let me draw. Did you already get a dragon this turn? She did somehow yeah. from her quest. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. So yep. she's doing another And then dragon. Flint, I'll get two crystal, please. All right. That's it. The dragon deck is looking light. The enchantment deck is uh, looking light. Okay. All right. All right. All right. I got. I know what I want to do. Right now, I'm gonna go visit over there at Flags and Dragons. We're gonna head over. Yeah. I know. I know. I, I, you're buying the first round, right? <laughs> I, am buying, I am buying the first round. It's going to be, you know, a little, uh, you know, crunchy bread. I'm good with that. Uh, all right. So we're gonna enchant over there, and it's going to be some orcish orchids. All right. And then that is three meat. Four points. And what was the other thing that I had to pay over there? Two crystal, right? Yeah. Two crystal. What color? Four points for green and a dragon. I'm going to take lavender because I would like lavender to start working in the town immediately. <laughs> um, we need to get those potion dragons. If you remember my flub from a couple turns ago, we need those to happen. So now I get to activate everything in there. And the first thing we're going to do. Yep is have Skewart put lavender <laughs> somewhere because we're not going to forget to get <laughs> lavender somewhere in town. Okay. So I've got a wild over there. I've got a wild over here. I think this is my two Just best options. options. There's a gold coin at the bazaar. That's not bad. Two of them, actually. Yeah. I mean, I do. I might want a coin, actually. Think about how this turn's going to go. This is going to mm. turn into that. Yeah, I think, the, I think the coin might be the way to go. So I'm going to put that over at the bazaar. Lavender's got a job now. And... I uh, get the gold coin. Then Cole is going to grab two of anything. We'll make it crystal. Uh, then Thistle can turn into any dragon. And what do we need? What do we need? What do we need? Well, we'll do that. Don't know what the next one of those is going to be. 
looks like iron and bread are needed, so we'll this will turn into flint. Whoops, sorry, where was I? On top of me. Okay. So then I'll use flint to grab two more of something. And I think uh let's see. Grab two iron. All right, then I'm gonna, at uh, the very last thing of my turn, I happen to have a fancy dragon that has an exclamation point. Mm -hmm. So this dragon says, on your turn, if you can pay five crystal, you can gain five points. So that's what I'm going to do. Woo. And get one, two, three, four, five. All right. Just slightly better. Ooh, there's the bizarre happening. I feel like you want to go here next anyway. I do. <laughs> I do want to go back to the bazaar. I can't wait to go back now that I've finally fixed my problem with potion dragon. Maybe you can enchant over there at the same time. Oh no, you can't do the shot power and enchant. That's the that's the mm -hmm. trade off. Yeah. Yeah. So. Yeah. What is happening over oh, here? Honey. Dang it. I was planning on going there. All right, so you just grabbed some, you grabbed a coin, right? By putting it there? Oh, no, yeah. Yeah, so you get a coin for placing honey there. Like mine just Before that turns over, though, oh, okay. he's we'll got to do his power. Yeah, he yeah. took a dragon yeah. from the... You used honey's uh, activation power. Yes. Okay, so now you have the power of the shop. Which means I can activate one of you these fancy dragons. You can turn over one of the fancy dragons and score it now, and then you can still score it at the end of the game. Okay. Uh... Toilet? Is that right? Mm. Yeah. Toilet? 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 Yeah, yeah. Uh, toilet? The names are not final. But uh, yeah. it's, it's, so I gain five points if I have uh, these two dragons in my hand? Yeah. Okay. 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 So you get five points? What if those stay in your again? hand, you're going to score that dragon again at the end. Okay. That's and now good. we fill out a shop. Which we have room, right? Yeah. Right over there. Okay. Of course. Yeah, we can go anywhere, yeah, really. Yeah. Uh, yeah. You know, the resources are currently crowding it, but... Dragon tail yeah. roost. So the roost, mm -hmm. the way it works is the item that you can get over there is actually drawing a dragon. Then the oh. slots are worth three reputation each, but you'll notice it says place face down because the dragons go to sleep over there. They just take a nap. Mm -hmm. So you, you have to put a dragon face down. They, they don't activate because they go to bed. Oh, but you get three hearts. But you get three hearts, and then you get to activate the power of the shop, which is choose a park dragon fire it, and then take it to your hand. So it is a good oh. dragon shop. Um, okay. I mean, and I don't know if this is going to work. If try here, two you know, dragons you know. get taken by anybody, that's it. And if two enchantments get done by players, that's it. Okay. I'm definitely so we're close. Out. It's a oh, race okay, here. So yeah, I mean, one of these is not going to happen. <laughs> <laughs> Things you th think about. Yep. You change my play up then. To your turn. Yeah. Well, I had, and then things changed. You moved <laughs> where I was looking at. So. You can still walk over here. Yeah. Uh, not for placing what I wanted. Oh, he wants to put something there. <laughs> yeah, I was going to place this, but no, I didn't. So I Tough something, said again. the kitty when the milk went dry. <laughs> <laughs> okay. We've got a good town going here. Yeah, yeah it's very, very vivid, I very do. vibrant. Yep. Tons of dragons. Tons of dragons. I'm gonna move here. And we've taken the um, enchantments and we've widened this out so they sit. They sit in the middle right there. Oh, nice. And then the fancies sit on the uh, the golds in the fountain, and the fancies are right there. So mm -hmm. Place this here. I get three. So you get three points. Uh, I'm going to activate. Did you draw a dragon for when you went there? I have not yet. Okay. Right, yeah, he's gonna trigger it right here. Patty. Okay, so there's a dragon that you just drew for face going down. there. Yeah. And you place the dragon face down and got your three reputation. And the last thing you get to choose do one is and pull it out. Okay, so I'm going to choose Cutlet. Okay, and he gets to fire this dragon before taking it. Yeah, so place any dragon, then gain whatever that might be there. Which can also include where you are. Oh, I have three hearts then. <laughs> and then I'll oh, do it again. Well, no, the power no, of the shop no. is done once, yeah. but you get oh, the okay. listed rewards, which is still. Okay. I mean, three it's, hearts. As, it's as good as here, so yeah. either way. It's a dragon with three hearts. Um, I'm going to take the three hearts. Yeah. All right. Okay. And then you get to keep Cutlet. Uh, yeah. And then that triggers it. Oh, wait. I don't know. Hold on. Yeah. 
Okay. <laughs> okay. That's not the one I'm going to be in your turn. That yes. Is the yes. End of his turn. So now everybody gets one more turn except for him. Then no, he gets the last turn. He does, yes. even though he ended it. Yes. Interesting. Okay. Mm -hmm. A little incentive yeah. to uh, you know get get the dragons uh, get it done. Oh, on my turn. Yes. My exclamation mark. I have five bread. Okay. So you're gonna pay those five bread for yep. five, five points. points. For what? Is, is there a fancy dragon? It's a fancy dragon one, that's one time instant. use. It's the ones with the but, exclamation yeah. point. Mm. So you do yeah. those on your turn. Okay, this is it. This is everyone's got one more turn and chant something or figure out a way to Get score any some points. Get points you can. Yeah. yeah. Alright. You sure you don't want to go over here and double score a fancy? Or you can yeah, gather resources. Not gonna now, will you get points at the end of the game for resources that you have? Only if you have a fancy that says so. Oh. Okay. Need Otherwise, the, it's only the coins. It's only the coins, unless you have some fancy that rewards you. That's my best way to get some points here. Hmm. I think, yeah, here, these two, and this one. Sitting or. La Merg, which will give me six points. So close. It's going to take down a couple of key things here. And then with, um... Huh. Skewer, I'll place a dragon down here to get three. Okay. Then, um... Cole gets your stuff. Yeah, do you two crystals. Alright. And two uh flint there. Yeah. And you just filled a shop, so that means another shop comes out. Okay. No, oh this Yeah, one. you just yeah. filled out the room. Okay. Out back Drake house. And then it's <laughs> my last turn, right? Love it. Yeah, this okay. is your last turn. I can complete an enchantment, but I do not place it in town. Right. So, uh. If you got the stuff, you yeah, can do I do, one more. but I want. Anything you can, yeah. More. Yeah, this one will only give me four, but that's fine. Oh. Okay. So I have a real special one plus four. Uh oh. So I'm sorry. And you technically just triggered Endgame again, because now we're at yes. uh, thing, so yeah. Did, did you move it? I did no, move it. Yeah. One, two, three, four. Okay. And a dragon. Yep. Don't think it matters for me, but final enchantments. Boy, I am not positioned for my bread. last turn here. Ironically, I have this fancy that just um, that as you guys are opening more shops, it's harder for me because mm. <laughs> it's to <laughs> fill all the dragons on one side of town, and you guys are oh. just expanding town. So that, one's out. <laughs> that dragon's not going to happen. Mm -hmm. I could okay. go to the bazaar. And reveal the other one, which would then score a second time. That might be my best shot here um, to get some points. I think I've looked at the. I don't really have the goods for any of these things unless I start dipping into my coins, which would be, you know, taking less points away. Point. Yeah. So I think instead I am going to go to the bazaar. Ooh, that Mike. means I'm going to have to use something. Bread, here. please. You want bread? Absolutely. All right, there's some bread for you. <laughs> there's a day old donut. Enjoy. Um, all right. So then what I'm going to do is I get to take one of anything. Uh, what is it going to be? It doesn't really matter unless... Lavender turns into what would it matter for? Could get a fancy. Is there a fancy slot? There is one that just opened. Mm -hmm. So Lavender could basically turn into a meat dragon and go get me another fancy shot. Mm -hmm. In order for that to happen, I need a dragon in my hand. So uh, let's. Can you do it all in one go? Yeah, let's let's take an iron for the bazaar. Okay. okay. Then I get, uh, there's no dragons to place. Um, but I do get to fire something. Unfortunately, Lavender. since I'm not doing an enchantment, I can't do what I just thought, which is get something and fire the next one. So it's really going to have to be Basil just to get some extra points here. Yeah. So I'll gift. Uh, you're done, so you can have an iron. And then uh, I'll take two points for that. Okay. And then I will do the final thing, which is the power of the store. I'll reveal Venti again. Ta-da! There are at least four of these, right? One, two, Full three... Reveal. For the Four. First time. Yeah, <laughs> there's actually five uh, potion now, so now it's a okay. five pointer. One, two, three, four, five. Nice. And that's my turn. Final turn. Okay. I move my guy here. 
Place. Um, get a meat. I get a meat. Okay. Yep. Then I'm going to go ahead and place a dragon. It's going to okay. net me two points. Two points. We're going to place awesome. some meat there. And then I'm huh. going to mm-hmm. place. Makes, makes a difference one of mine. I'm then going to do this. Give somebody an item. Okay. Who's behind? Yeah. There's only one person with a turn left. So yeah, I'm going to give it to somebody who. Yeah, either one of them then. Here, you can have a whole lot of stuff. I'm okay. done. Okay. I'm going to. Oh, I can actually I can pay. What's this thing? Yeah, pay one. Pay for, dollar to oh. get one of everything. It's only if you had fancies that would maybe help you out if you had more okay. stuff. Mm-hmm. I'm going to go to Outback. I'm going to have a you know, have Cutlet start working here. Talk so here. I get three. Talk here, you guys. So I get three hearts over here. Uh huh. Uh, so Last turn, one, he's got two, three, three hearts to go there. Um, Technically speaking, you've got to meet when you went there. I, this might matter for some people's end game goals. Okay, so you should always take all the stuff. Um, by placing Cutlet, then I can place another dragon um, and either gain the gain the, the <laughs> keep talking this way, or I'll just get louder. Gain either no, that doesn't gold, help. Gain either the gold or the heart. Um, so looking at the board, oh, but I have to place it out of my hand. Mm-hmm. The dragon's you going out of your hand. Match. Do I have to do that? Nope, you do not. I uh, not to. Okay, because he's trying to get his uh, end goal again. Yep. All right. So then that's, that's it. it. The shop power is to place a dragon, though. So he's not going to do the shop power. But just so everyone knows, that one is you can mm. place a dragon ignoring the type and get double whatever it says. Ooh. It's a pretty yeah. good uh, shop, actually. Oh, yeah. All right. And so that, that triggers the end that, game. That's it. That's it. Yeah. We're going to score this up. So what, what happens, finishes the end game, yeah. So what happens mm. now is first coins. If you have any coins, you turn them in, Nada. you get points. Oh, you have to turn these in. You have to turn these in. One point each. Oh, you needed it for something else, huh? Okay. Sorry. Okay. Turn all your coins in and you get the points. Four. I had none. We'll see what we'll see what your score would have been. I'm sorry I didn't mention that part. No, I I, I thought ahead just in case that oh, might okay. have been all right. All right. <laughs> Uh, the next thing that happens is we turn over the fancies that are end game and we start scoring those. And you can do this you can do this simultaneously, but I like to kind of everyone In order to do for it. Somebody learn the game. Yeah. 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 So yeah. Uh, you want to start so, over there? Sure. So for instance, my Todd that gives me uh, three points. One, two, three. So Todd, if you were odd. And then if I'm odd now? Or if I was odd you previously. You choose when no, you choose when to do it, but if you're activating Todd on thirty, you are not odd. So because I spent the coin, though, moving me from 28 to 30. 29. 29 uh, to 30. Coins are first, dragons are second. Oh. Maybe you can score that one first. You got another one Will to score? Be... Another end? Is that what you're saying? Yeah. I, I have do. two scores and an end. Well, okay. so the, all the dragons that don't have an exclamation point are at the end. So it's, forget the word it says. We're, we changed that to be. Okay. Well, so if you have another one that gets you odd, it'll work out. If you don't, then he's just getting you three. Well, I've, so right now I'm at what I'm at thirty. Uh, yeah. So I can use um, toilet here, right? And right. I can reveal yep. these guys exactly, which will give you five, five Right now you score Todd. Okay, I and see. And you are odd. <laughs> so uh, now you're getting six. He actually okay. gives more points if you are at an odd score when you score him. Okay. And then the and final you're one, the last one is Candice. Thank you for the bread, <laughs> because oh. otherwise I would have not been able well, to. Well, no, that's not. Um, if your town has, oh, if it's town dragons, has, it's talking about dragons. If there's at least one, four two, bread three, dragons four. in town, oh yeah, there's there actually are. five. Okay, so you score five points. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I was going for that the entire. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it worked <Okay>. out. <laughs> it worked <laughs> out. I don't think I could catch you, so okay. I think you got me. Let's see what these other two I do. Don't here. know if I will either. Um, unfortunately, Thunder, I did not get six dragons on my hand because I got this late, uh, you're on and there were not game. enough dragons left to really get it without triggering the end game, so that didn't happen. There's all these guys that you didn't even bother. They're sitting there all get, sad and lonely. Up, I would have had to figure out how to pick up three in one turn. That's yeah. true. Yeah. Which yeah, is right too late here. To get it. Actually. But, um, Next time, drink and no, cakes. That's yeah. your secret chef. Okay, so matches, I um, didn't. Didn't you get drop a, a whole track. bunch of dragons over there for points, <laughs> though? <laughs> That's your fault. Yeah. Because I know that, no. You got points. It's fine. I was at three. I couldn't pick up three more. Mm-hmm. Next. Uh, I already was moving on. You stopped me. Uh, I got matches. I get one heart for each shop that has a matching dragon type in it all okay. the way around the board. Aww. So my question then is for the, the wilds. The wild does not count. Oh. Yeah. So you Sorry. get the wilds are out. one. The dragon that. shop is out. So you get one, two. two. No, no, no. So it's two. crystal. Let's start over there. So there's a crystal at this yeah. shop. Oh. So oh, Outback yeah, okay. Drake House has one. This has one. Two. This has three. one. Three. 
for... Wait, wait. Oh, matching for... Yes, matching yeah. the type of shop. Doesn't, because you guys move things. Mm. Yes. Doesn't... Should doesn't should count. More Five. Six. 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 Okay, so that's I got six good. points for that. It's hard to do a little bit, but I got six. That was that. And I get five points if I have both a, um, a leaf and an iron card in my hand, which I do. Very so I nice. get five for that, and that's... All, uh, all she's saying. Wow, that was a big point thing. That if you, uh, wow, mm -hmm. you can get like twelve points if you're. I don't you're think you can get twelve. Only four because of Mike. the way it works out. I think Mike's oh. got you it. don't count the dragon shops, the coin shops, or the wild shops. Mm -hmm. Okay. So it doesn't. I was wondering about that for a while. Like as long as you have a dragon there, all right. <laughs> there still wouldn't be enough. If the town has at least four green dragons, gain one heart for each. Three, Are you four, I see at least four, yeah, four. five. There's One, five. two, three, four, four five. five. There you go. Yeah. Right. How many points do you get? Five. 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 And then Thirty-eight. Two points if you have at least three crystals, plus three if you have the most. And I have seven, I have the most. So five. Five. Okay. Look at you guys. And I, unfortunately, man, it just didn't work out. I have Venti again, which is five okay. points. This one was filled the entire side of town. So that did not that happen. Happened. Yeah. So there I stay. Wait, wait. Okay. Fill the what? If entire the side. entire side of town is filled, I get some points. But the entire side. What one do you mean? Like, the entire side, yeah, side of holes. town just has there's like holes. all the dragon holes filled. You need every shop completely it's a hard capacity one. for workers. Do you mean like every dragon has to be on every one side, on one one side, side. of town? So well, whenever you place them, so yeah, we would have technically shops. those would have like, not been be there. Here, they would have there. been. They would have been an. Then do you make them spot. equal yeah. then back and forth? Is what you do when you place them no. normally? You can place them however you want. So the person with this quest is trying to make a shorter side and fill oh, it. Okay. Mm -hmm. And I was completely not in charge of the shops because yeah. everyone else was doing it. Yeah. And I was like, this is not going to happen. So and then you, you were yeah, adding more. And I was like, even if you put them on that side, it's not done. And then all of a sudden, Outback came out. I was like, okay, forget it. Yeah, just forget it. Holes both sides. But it's a fun one to try and work on. Because How many points can you get? It? Uh, it's like a point per uh, shop that's all that's filled. One, two, three. So, so it potentially be, you know, it three, six, three, seven, three six to six. Seven pointer, yeah. Which is a pretty good one for the fancies. Okay. And is there anything else? That's it. That's it, yeah. It. The winner. The flame Michael. Michael. Yeah. Flame Yeah. Flame Allie's Flame second, I'm third, Most and Peter's fourth. Reputation in town. Um, I, 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 I didn't know if I'd like this game, but after playing and, 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 and uh, drastically <laughs> dominating, <laughs> I can say that I had much better enjoyed it. Drastically dominate. Uh, it was an this was a very close game. You guys did great. And by very close, you mean an embarrassment for all of you. Because <laughs> I, I, I mean, stopped For me, because I know this game and I completely flubbed it. But that's okay. I'm glad you guys got it. You were enchanting left and right. Yeah. There yeah. was a lot of... First enchanter. You know. so, really? yeah, it's so funny. Enchanted more. It's very <laughs> simple as far as what to do. Two options. Options, but it starts getting to the point where I'm like, I'm just gonna pick the really thing complex. that sounds easiest. Like after, right. I'm like, that oh my gosh, like, I don't even know. Okay, this one that'll get me four points. That sounds like a good turn. Four points. Like <laughs> I don't have much left, um, and I need to keep this. So I was like trying to keep my brain not too like well, then build resources overloaded. to then be able to pay for the enchantments. Like yeah, it, one of the things that Manny lot. really wanted too is that it's not um, it's not like my store. So that it's all my combos. If I do a really cool combo, you could just come and follow and do that exact yeah. same yeah. combo. Yeah. So like I started seeing the tavern was really good, and you got three coins from it. So if I had the time, that was a great one to go back to and get three coins, right? Now yeah. what if we were tied? Now if you're tied, the tiebreaker is number of dragons in hand. Oh. Okay. Who is the next person? I have four. Oh, she would have taken it. But, yeah, but, but we include fancy dragons, too. No, no. Just artisan <laughs> dragons. And if it's a tie with artisan dragons, you go to items. And, ooh, that's another tough call. One, okay. two, three. So yeah, you... Callie had a lot. So, Callie, you so were in second might... place. Mm -hmm. And uh, wait, wait, so this is you? Me. Or no, you? No, yeah. I'm in the back here. <laughs> yeah. He was too busy teaching the game. Yeah. I, I don't know what happened. Go and eat. I, I missed the, the venti move was bad. First, second, then... second to last, and you were teaching, so you get a, <laughs> uh, you get a, what do you call it? Uh, you know, it, doesn't, it doesn't count. Yeah, it doesn't I'm count. So That's what you want. He's to trying to be, he's the, he's the um, anti-John DeClaire. John comes over to like just curb stop. Oh, yeah. he's ruthless. He's so ruthless. Yeah, we all ended with like four points to each other. That so it's not bad. It's a really close game. Yeah, mm -hmm. a lot going on. Uh, a lot going on, and a lot of fun too, mm -hmm. which I, yeah. I like. Yeah. Uh, pretty straightforward once you get into it. I, and I it's love kind the theme. Of, I love the artwork. It just it's yeah, it's very immersive. 
it's kind of a training thing. Like, it, it trains you as you play the game. Like sure. it starts off very simple. There's not a whole lot of extra powers and whatnot. And as you kind of get into it slowly but surely, you start realizing there's the complexity and there's the interesting combinations. Like first couple rounds, you're like, oh, okay, pretty straightforward. And then afterwards, yeah. you're like, ah, I now know what I need to do in the game and how I can implement the different options. Uh, after the first couple rounds, you have those options to kind of like you get things level crazy. Level up as you play, which is really nice. Really yeah, yeah. good design. There. Yeah, I love the, um, and of course, if you play and you're used to it, you can just decide what the starter. You don't have to put the starters in. You can put like, ah, let's put the bank put, in right, yeah. right away. You can put special. Yeah, drops because in for example, you know, it's it's mostly to make sure that everybody has an entry point and can get in. Mm -hmm. But like, there's going to be tons of shops. So if you really want to play a certain style, you can stick those right in and go. So is this what is this right here? Is this the whole base game, or this, is this, this... What you're seeing is kind of a hodgepodge. Now, the mat's going to be in everyone's game. All the okay. art's going to be in everyone's game. So all dragons, all art. Heck yes. Okay? The thing that you... And then you get uh, cardboard uh, resources and coins, and, and then you get uh, these little wooden dragons, okay? So you then you have to decide, do I want to go mini dragons and actual pieces of little toast and gold coins? Okay, so the dragons in general for the base game are... They're like, they're wooden... wooden uh, dragon meeple tokens. kind of things. Meeples. Wood okay. meeples. Okay, yeah. and then these are the more, these are the like upgrade expansion. That's the upgrade. Now, is there a deluxe version of the game? So, or is yeah, it so what be... it's going to be is it's a base game where you get all the art and all the, and the map. Megans? And the, what what do you it? call it now? Megans? What do you call that for a dragon? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Metascreel. Um, and Sorry. then there's going to be a deluxe, which has uh, game trays, and it has all the minis, and it has the coins and stuff. Can I pay for that now? <laughs> I mean, sure. We'll, we'll, we'll work this out. But you can also go piecemeal. So, like, if you don't want to go for everything, you're like, I don't really, I don't need the gold coins or whatever because I've got my two dwellings of all the real coins, whatever. Mm -hmm. But the I want the these look so cool. Uh, well, those are those are the dwellings ones as temporary uh -huh. use in here. But what I'm saying is, there's going to be a piecemeal way you could go. Mm -hmm. We're gonna we're we're working on making a plush and an art book, so you can decide if you want those kind of things. Or is pulling out the game. Roughly the, like, roughly the size honestly, of the really game. Like the it's roughly the size of the game. It's not the right... That we did a prototype. Right, right, thin, right. But, but this is about what it is. And then if you go deluxe, it'll be with the game trays that holds all the mm -hmm. stuff. Mm -hmm. Honestly, I really like the artwork. So it's the awesome. deluxe version of the game will come with... If you want it to, you can have it come with everything. The everything. game trays. Comes, mm -hmm. We're going to try and make it really easy with just two tiers. Do I want the base game or do I want the deluxe? And then at the end of the campaign, then, you know, if you on. want to add on. And then there'll be all the add-ons as well. So you can kind of decide. Like, I, There's even some people who, I was thinking about this, might want to just buy an extra set of these little dragons because they're super cute. So mm -hmm. that way, if you just you can decide what you want at the end. Yes, please. <laughs> right? <laughs> so, yeah, we're trying to make it uh, flexible for everybody. I know some people who come in and say, yeah, I, don't, I, don't, I just want the game and her art. So we've got mm -hmm. you covered with a basic one. But then if you say, I can't resist the pieces of the little steak and the toast, I gotta have them. <laughs> and she's done a lot of dragons for like wizards and, all and, kinds of stuff, and yeah. all that kind of uh, stuff. Yeah. Ooh, I wonder what dragons she's done for uh, for maybe Magic the Gathering, probably some, some I'm dragons. I'm sure there? there's some magic dragons. Yeah. I'd be very yeah. curious. I mean, uh, fantastic big dragons. Um, but then these little cute artisan dragons are, are just yeah, charming like as song. well. This was kind of the really cool. um, her Instagram, right? She was like, is that what you're saying? Like so she kind of was one just of the first pieces that and, came out was the creme brulee dragon and mm. and just you know what if t dragons were in town just doing <laughs> normal jobs you know at the starbucks or they're just they're just uh they're with you and they're they're in all these different shops and that what if turned into like pieces that she put, kept putting on instagram mm. and yeah. eventually we said uh we could there's a game for that there's a mm -hmm. game where you play and move the dragons around so what was first the design or the art I believe <laughs> the art was first, but then Manny mashed it with a game where he was thinking about a town builder. Mm -hmm. Manny definitely too. Uh, if anyone's played Sparkle Kitty, uh, oh, yeah. not a fan of take that stuff. Which you know, at first that. I was like, oh, let's <laughs> let's make it so that you have some like. He's like, no, we're not going to make a town that's vindictive. It's going to be a town where <laughs> everyone builds on everyone else's stuff. Semi-cooperative, but still self-interest for your own points. Yes, yeah, so you're still trying to win for yourself, but you're also. Uh, you're just boosting yeah. the whole And at the end, you have an awesome town. Mm -hmm. and, it worked out, and it worked out with job. her world, yeah. because in her world, I mean, technically speaking, she did have another type, which was war dragons. We're going to save that for uh, some time gonna, in the future in expansion. Pocket, pocket. But so, yeah, the war dragons we took out so that we could just focus on the you know, the town, town the yeah. building, the Civilian kind of cooking, life. and the, you know, making the pots at the... It's very mm -hmm. cute. Excellent game. I want to play it again. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, yeah. All right.
So if you guys enjoyed uh, the game walkthrough, hopefully you have it on uh, YouTube here, um, kind of edited it up a little bit. August 10th. Up. August 10th is where you will be seeing on Kickstarter. There'll be a link below in the description uh, when that pops up. Until then, there'll be a link in the description for uh, the Facebook group. So I'll, I'll get it from you and put nice. it down below. And you can see the Facebook group and see all the stuff going on. Peter regularly updates and keeps people kind of... We do. Kind we of leak new art in there. and We should be showing the plush soon there. We're currently giving a prize in the Facebook group where you can win an art print from Sandara. So there's lots of cool things going on yes. in the Facebook group. So, yeah, overall, excellent game. Really mm -hmm. enjoyed it. Mm -hmm. um, didn't know what to expect at first yeah. because it was like, what, what is going on? Like, there's, oh, it's all these tiny cards come out. Yeah, but very, very enjoyable. Like, it's like a town dragon builder, competitive, but, like, feels cooperative in a way because you're building and working yeah. together to make a beautiful town. Yeah, it's just a lot of fun. Uh, another solid home run, Manny. Uh, great job. And, of course, the artwork, well, is, is excellent as well. So, yeah. And this yeah, be some of those games where if you've got somebody who's really good at engine builders, hint, hint, <laughs> but then if once that person gets their engine it, going, the I rest of you're screwed. It's a little bit of an engine builder. But, but I mean, not it's, individually. It's, it's cooperative. Because you all have yeah. access to the same spots. So, so it's not where game, one person uh, just Jarkon locks it up. From Tom Jolly? Yes. Yeah, so what I like about oh, like Jarkon, too, yeah. is that if someone sets up a chain... Everyone can just go and use that chain. And the same thing happens here. One time I was using a potion shop to swap out all these dragons and get a bunch of bread. And Manny saw that and he's like, I think I can I'll do that, do too. that exact yeah, same I, thing. And I, I noticed that in the game, too, which is why over here, when I saw that get three resources, get three, get three, yeah. I'm like, that's really great. But I also don't want to give somebody that because like, yeah. they'll stay there because I have the ability to like transfer all the dragons. So, right. 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 so you get them out of there. Yeah. So I'm like, yeah. I'm not going to give somebody nine resources when they come here of their choice, basically. <laughs> so right. I'm exactly. going to like manipulate this mechanic, this engine, to kind of give you a, you know, it's decent. But I also have to suffer because I choose, yeah. you know. So I'm like, okay, I'll take a dragon because I need a dragon, but you guys don't. So, yeah, none of the engines are in a vacuum. Like everybody else has access to the same resources, same like. But you can kind of control yeah. who's allowed uh, what based on how you place the dragons yeah, around, and that kind of, of goes in with the ability to move the dragons. Yeah, from place one to time place. I saw uh, someone engineer really a shop to have three meat dragons in it, and then the roost came up, and they just went boom, boom, boom into the roost for nine. Wow! But that's a combo you can't follow, right? So someone's like, locks ah. it, yeah. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's a really good turn. Wow. Okay. I know it was it was wow. wild. I was like, oh my god, there's so many fun things you can do, mm -hmm. uh, especially if you have a turn where you get three potion dragons in a shop. Then you're god. But other people can jump on that too, though, because you can't put all three you know reds down. No. Well, he no, you could. He you had put to leave, the he turn, had to leave all the reds there. Somebody else after that right. thing could do. Right. Okay. So they could still take do a, the meat. Yeah. a couple rounds to do it. Yeah. Well, I right, thank game. you so much for bringing yeah, it over. I had a lot of fun. Yeah, Hopefully you guys did as well. Mm -hmm. um, we will be talking about the game when it comes out on the 10th, probably on the week of as well. Give another nice. shout-out so you guys can get a look at it, and we'll be obviously sharing it out as well. Uh, but, yeah, this is a solid game. You guys mm -hmm. should definitely take a look at the campaign and decide for yourself if it's something you'd like to pick up. But for those of you guys who like a little bit of an engine builder, something that's friendly but also competitive at the same time, beautiful artwork, uh, Flamecraft is a solid choice. First time playing, first time seeing it, other than just a couple pictures online. But yes, I really, really did uh, enjoy it. And cool. it Dragon is a 60 minute game. Management. Everything about it is actually <laughs> as stated. You're getting exactly what you expect to get when you see the game, which is also nice. And a lot of games don't like that. You know, a lot yeah. of games you think, oh, it's a 60 minute game. It's not a 60 minute, it's a four hour game. <laughs> yeah. It's fine, but you know, tell me four hours. <laughs> I'm yeah, ready yeah, for right. it. I think people are going to play that regularly. Two Dragon Claws up. <laughs> nice. <laughs>